There's a new development in a story we first brought you several weeks ago. The petition making its way through the capital city and surrounding towns to bring a VA hospital to the area now has hundreds of signatures. Good day, Illinois. Akila Davis is outside the VA outpatient clinic with more on how the organizer says the community has helped. Akila. Well, hey, good morning. The Vietnam veteran spearheading this petition now saying it's garnered close to 2,000 signatures, and that does not include the other signatures that are unaccounted for, the ones still out in local towns. Now, since the start of the petition circulating through Springfield, Vietnam veteran Maurice Renfro says he's gotten an outpouring of community support. He says veterans from all across central Illinois have contacted him eager to sign the petition and to have others in the community do the same. He says veterans from as close as Springfield and Decatur to as far as Quincy have reached out. Renfro says the main concern is when veterans need treatment, they are forced to travel to cities like St. Louis, Chicago or Peoria, something he says they shouldn't have to do. There are some people that have to travel that have cancer and they have to travel back and forth and that's pretty hard on them. There should be a place right here in town because it's hard on the patient and it's also hard on the family member that has to do the transporting. Now Renfro says he still has several petitions out in local towns. He expects to have more than 2,000 signatures once he collects them all. He has set a July 31st deadline before he submits the signatures to Senator Dick Durbin. And if you'd like to sign that petition, you can. All you got to do is contact that number on your screen. For now, reporting in Springfield, Akila Davis, Good Day, Illinois.